own native New Zealand insect could save the agricultural industry millions of dollars every year. Christchurch scientists have discovered a natural predator to the invasive grouse grub. Now they're investigating how it might be used. Mike Thorpe reports. This Southbridge wheat field could hold the secret to long-term grass grub control. Ooh, there's one. Nah, lost him. The breakthrough came late last year when researchers from the Foundation for Arable oh, Research yeah. Yeah. went hunting for grass grub. We managed to find a larval stage of something that was eating the pupa for the, of the grass grub, and that's totally unheard of. It took us probably two months to find out what the insect was that was predating on the grass grub. The invader was the younger form of this native fly, the Astenia robusta. The fly is actually in this larval stage uh, when, when it's eating the grass grub pupa. A discovery that could have a major impact on our agricultural industry. Well grass grub is one of New Zealand's most expensive insect pests and every year it costs New Zealand agriculture millions of dollars in loss production, uh, chemical control costs and additional regrassings. Although there are numerous methods for controlling grass grub, modern practices have seen many of those eradicated. Chemical groups that we're using to control grass grub are getting more and more difficult to gain registration for and there's been some pushback on those chemicals in Europe. It's not clear yet how well the fly inhabits areas outside of Canterbury, but experts believe there's nothing to fear from increased fly numbers. You know they're predatory, so they aren't going to cause fly strike or issues like that. They're unlikely to be a nuisance pest to people living in, in small towns or townships. They're likely that they could be beneficial in some of those scenarios because they're, they're likely to eat fleshy, small fleshy insects. Aphids, etc. Early signs suggest those numbers are already on the rise, which scientists are hoping means grass grub numbers are declining. Mike Thorpe, One News.